Well, here she is, direct from the convent, the wonderful Miss Dixie Leonard. Well, hi. <laughs> Are you trying to get into my flax suit, honey? I'm just trying to debrief you. I want some hugging and some squeezing and some hugging and some teasing and some stuff like that there. Dixie sang the songs. It's a bunch of horny guys. I mean, how are you going to lose, right? In that case, let me add them. Eddie told the jokes. Two hours along with you, that boy deserves a purple heart. Well, it was purple, all right, but I don't think it was his heart. And for over 50 years together. The two of you are going to be bigger than Burns and Allen. Bigger than Hope and Crosby. The battle between them never ended. You got a toilet for a mouth, and I don't appreciate it. Him and Hitler, they probably have the same agent. But neither did the magic. Just relax and follow my lead. Yeah, right off a cliff. <laughs> you just let me teach you and nothing will stop us. We'll be bigger than, we'll be bigger than all of them. So tell me about this career place. It's a tropical paradise. On behalf of our fighting men and women everywhere, you're doing a magnificent job. P.S. I love you. Alone in the dark with thousands of men. There is a God after all. They did it for the laughter. They did it for the tears. But most of all, they did it for the boys. Come on, sweetheart, sing! Well, if you feel that way about it. And baby, you.